Hey guys, my name is Alex Ryan. Welcome back to the studio. Today's topic is why launching an Amazon business, why starting your own Amazon business is probably one of the best things you could do. Let's get started. Welcome back everyone, so glad to have you here with me. My name is Alex Ryan, author of How to Import from China and Make a Fortune. I've been teaching people how to import from China uh, safely and not get ripped off from Alibaba and all those other places uh, for a while now. And uh, today's topic is all about Amazon and some pretty crazy stats about Amazon. First of all, Amazon can process up to 600 sales per second. 600 sales per second, people buying uh, from Amazon, isn't that crazy? Uh, 380 million dollars of sales per day. That's Amazon. 380 million dollars of sales every single day. That amounts to one point, uh, 136 billion of sales per year. Incredible, isn't it? Amazing. 600 sales per, can be processed per uh, per minute. Most people on Amazon, they're not the big players. They're people just like you, just like me. They could be mums and dads and brothers and sisters who have an idea, who have a potential product and uh, they're selling items on, on Amazon. Most people are ordinary folk. Most people, they could be the person next door, right? Now the growth of Amazon needs you, they are reliant on you. So it doesn't matter where you are, whether you're in Australia, New Zealand, America, UK, Europe, Amazon needs more people, they need more range. And every single day, this is the power of Amazon. Every single day there's new products coming to market, whether they're from China or other places, there's new products coming to market and it's a big opportunity for you to find those hot products, to go and find the products and list them first on Amazon. And that's really, the race is on. That's why it's important to actually understand uh, how to import from China, how to contact factories, and how to find those hot products. I go to China every year. You don't have to, but I certainly do. I love it. I love, I go to the Guangzhou Fair, which is also called the Import Export Fair. Uh, I go there usually once a, a minimum once a year, and I'm going again this year. I'm also in Shanghai in December, uh, but guys, Importing, finding products for Amazon, it's just gonna get bigger. Amazon is growing uh, massively every single day and they need more range. They need you to find hot products. They need you to go out there and, uh, and basically find new products to list for their stores to help them grow. Now, they want more range. That's, that's known, all right? That's, that's known, uh, known already. Now, product searches, 55% of all product searches are done on Amazon. So not Google, they don't go to Google Shopping, they don't go to eBay, they go to Amazon. 55% of all product searches are done on Amazon. Now, Amazon have zero comp competitors. You've probably seen some pictures of, uh, what's his name, Jeff Bezos, right? The richest man in the world. Um, now, they started off as a bookstore and now they are selling whatever they want to sell. That's how that's how he's uh, transformed himself. And they have zero competitors, zero competitors. Did you know that Walmart is planning, uh, they're planning on getting their customers on the way home from work to, you know, to deliver products that people have ordered online and they'll pay them a little bit more, but that's really the competition, all right? Walmart is trying to compete, but that's no, there's no competition. Amazon is a giant and they're eating it up. They're buying logistics, they're buying warehouses constantly, they're expanding. Um, if any more startups come or if there is another business that comes and tries to compete, Amazon will either buy them out or get rid of them and destroy them through competition. That's the power of Amazon. Um, is it good or bad for independence coming up? Well, it's probably bad, but if you're selling on Amazon and you're importing from China and you're, going and you're, you're finding stuff, a hot products to list and, you, and you're selling on Amazon, then it's a great opportunity for you. Uh, but most growth, on Amazon is the new sellers, all right? Uh, it's the new products and the new sellers. That's the most growth that um, Amazon is having. It's not the old products, it's not the big corporations, it's just new products, all right? Uh, so that's why it's important to actually know how to find hot products. What you don't wanna do 
is you don't want to import something or sell something on Amazon that is already selling like crazy and is very competitive niche. Because what you end up doing is jumping in that niche and you will essentially have a bidding war. You'll be dropping a price, they'll be dropping the price, you'll be dropping your price, and eventually none of you guys will be making money. So that's why it's important to find hot products, guys. All right, so today's topic was essentially the growth of Amazon and the importance of finding hot products. My name is Alex Ryan. Thanks for joining me here in the studio, guys. If you want to check out some more free videos on importing from China, finding hot uh, products, finding great supplies overseas, and launching an Amazon business, visit my website right now. Uh, it's on the screen right here. Or give us a call, 02 8003 7534. That's an Australian phone number, by the way. But give us a call. My name's Alex Ryan. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see you real soon. Bye bye.